the dot product of two vectors. Now, we look at this, these statements. The first one says, if a, if u, where u is a vector, equal a1, a2. All right. What does that mean? What does that mean? The vector u equals a1, a2. Now remember, it's these um, types of brackets that you use when you represent vectors in brackets. You have a vector and it is a position vector. Let's say you have your x and y axis, y axis and x axis. The vector you're talking about might be something like this, alright? Where this this end where it starts at origin zero zero. This end is over a one and beside a two. Alright? So that's a one a two. You see that? See what I mean? Let me redraw it. This is your vector. That is your vector. And the point, the end point, is over. It could be below. If it's below the x-axis, a1, and this is a2. For example, if you had, say, 0, 1, 2, 3, and this went up to, say, 6, the vector would be 3, 6. Right? A1 just means, uh, represents the x and the a2, the y. And then, you have uh, v, the other vector. V is equal to B1, B2. You see that? So, vector B. Let's say this is vector B. Vector B is here. And B is the tip, the end is above B, B1. And beside B2. See that? Then, the dot product of these vectors is U dot V is equal to. Now, how do you get the dot product? Notice here that the A1 and the B1 are the horizontal components. And the A, B, A2 and B2 are vertical components. Product means to multiply. And when you're multiplying, you must multiply horizontal by horizontal and vertical by vertical. So, it should be Horizontal times horizontal plus vertical plus by vertical, right? So, what does that give you? U contains A1. So, it's A1 times the B contains B1. B1. Alright, A1 times B1 plus, then you have your A2, vertical now, times B2. You see that? So you see, 
A1B1 plus A2B2. So you notice it is horizontal multiplied plus vertical multiplied. You cannot mix up horizontal and vertical together. You have to keep them separate. So you have A1 horizontal for U times B1 the vertical, the horizontal for V plus A2 the vertical for U times B2 the vertical for V. So that is the dot product. So U V U dot V is equal to A1 B1 plus A2 B2. That's the dot product there as you have it. Alright. After that, we're going to, after this, we're going to break at this video now. And we're going to come in the next video to these properties and see how they work out.